Hey there, Fruit Loops. It's Thursday, and I'm Clyde. This week, we're gonna tell you what book you should read. And everyone who watches my videos on my regular channel knows that I love books probably more than anyone in the world should love books or could love books. So it's really hard to narrow it down to one. So I'm just going to stick with the topic at hand, which is what book helped you when you were trying to accept your gayness? And that book for me would be The Straight Girl's Guide to Lesbianism. I don't know who wrote it. I'm not even sure it's an actual book. It could just be like some kind of really long pamphlet that I had. But I found it in Pensacola at a used bookstore and I sent it to my friend. It was great because it was like, oh, I'm still a straight girl, but I'm just trying to understand lesbianism. Just a study, just some research, not any sort of a big deal. Uh, but it explained a lot of like how lesbians have sex and how you can meet lesbians. However, the book I found that I have in my possession I would like to show you is called The Dyke Detector. Don't worry, someone gave me this as a joke and first of all, it is signed by the author. <laughs> I mean, this book is going places. It's signed by the author. This is the first edition, totally signed. Really amazing, thank you, what a nice gift. Apparently, we also thought it was a good idea uh, to bedazzle it. Her thigh is bedazzled. <laughs> I don't know what's going on with this book. But it's kind of hilarious, and it says, we've, <laughs> so hard to wrangle this book. We've never met a dyke who faked an orgasm. We've never met a dyke who had to. We don't know how this will help you detect them. I, it's kind of funny, I, I think this book is awesome. And like I said, first edition, if you want this book, I will send it to you if you comment me what you're gonna do with it, who you're gonna give it to. Let's just pass it along so we can all detect dykes everywhere. And um, then we can make sure, beyond a reasonable doubt, that they are not faking any kind of orgasm. Anyway, I hope you guys have a great week, and I'll see you next Thursday. The end. Love, Clyde.